Hi students, welcome to Engineering Graphics. I am Dr. Vinod Kumar. You have got a practical problem here in Hyperbola. You are given to draw a Boyle's law curve with a point, the status of the point is given. Volume equal to 0.5 meter cube corresponding to a pressure of 1 kilogram force per centimeter square. That is the state of, of the gas at a point is state of gas at the point is it has got a volume of 0.5 meter cube and the corresponding pressure is 1 kilogram force per centimeter square. You are asked to draw the curve when the gas is compressed. Draw the curve when the gas is compressed. That means you have to fix up a relationship between volume and x axis and also a relationship between pressure and y axis. You have to fix that scale first, then you can draw. Let us take it like this. X axis. X axis. Where is where we use P? 1 centimeter along x axis is equal to, let us take 0 0.05 meter cube. So, where is our point? Our point is 0.5 meter cube. 1 centimeter is 0 0.05 meter cube. So, it is 10 centimeter away. 10 centimeter away, draw a vertical line. Now, y axis. Y axis. I take 1 centimeter equal to it is 1 kilogram per centimeter square. I take 0.5 kilogram per centimeter square. So where is our point? Our point is 2 centimeters away. P. Now, do you know why I have taken P this far away? Because you are asked to draw the curve when the gas is compressed. When the gas is compressed, you know the curve will pressure will increase. The curve should go like this. It is with that intention that I have planned the point sufficiently to the right side. If you take P here, you will not get space for the compression. Agreed? Okay. Now, I take few points on this. One, two, I will erase this. What is the scale? X axis. 1 centimeter equals 0 0.05 meter cube. Y axis 1 centimeter equals point, I mean, 1 centimeter is 0.5 kilogram per centimeter square. I take 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I take one point to this side, 6. Agreed? Then I join them to the origin. What is this? 1 dash, 2 dash, 3 dash, 4 dash, 5 dash, 6 dash. Agreed? Okay. Draw vertical line through 1 dash and a horizontal line through 1. What is this? P1. Vertical line through 2 dash and a horizontal line through 2. P2. Vertical line through 3 dash and a horizontal line through 3. P3. Vertical line through 4 dash and a horizontal line through 4. P4. Vertical line through 5 dash and a horizontal line through 5. P5. Vertical line through 6 and a horizontal line through 6 dash. P6. This is the compulsive point. Now you can connect them. You can connect them by a smooth curve. Agreed? P1, P2, P3, P4, P5, P6.
Okay? You get the smooth curve. So it all depends upon how you take the scale. If you take the scale properly, you get a proper shape. So if you want to draw normal and tangent, what will you do? You can locate K here. If this is K where you want to draw normal and tangent, extend it, you get, I mean, draw a horizontal line, you get uh, L, take OL and mark here to get M, OL equals LM, OL equals LM, MK is the tangent at K and the perpendicular is the normal. Agreed? So similarly, you can draw any practical program. Agreed? The freedom of choosing the scale is completely yours. Okay? Thank you.